peeps and welcome back to my channel. Today we are back to play Wedding Designer. Imagine Wedding Designer that is. So we recently played this on my channel and I really enjoyed it. And in that video, we did something kind of crazy but kind of fun. Um, we basically picked everything wrong. Like every single thing that we could possibly pick for the wedding, I picked the opposite what the bride wanted. So today we're gonna do something a little bit different and I had this idea, right, and I hope it works. So I had the idea to um, let fate decide how the wedding is gonna go, right? So what I have here is this container with the letter B on it because alphabet, you know, I'm teaching you guys the alphabet, okay. Um, but I have these two stars, there's a red There's a red star and a green star. The red star means dislike and the green star means like. So what we'll do is for each and everything that we can pick for the wedding, we'll do a drawing. We'll pick a random star and if it says, you know, if it says, it doesn't say anything, I'm stupid, okay? If we get a green star, that means I'll pick what the bride wants. If we get a red star, I'll pick the opposite of what she wants. And we'll just see how this goes. This could work, could also not work. I don't know. But today we are here with our bride, Hannah. She is Canadian. So here's the thing. Canadians are really nice. Um, or as they say. Um, but you know what? I will say that people say the same thing about Minnesotans, right? They say Minnesota nice, that everyone in Minnesota is nice. That's not true. So I don't know. This chick could potentially cut me. Like, I, d I don't know. But we're going to find out. So let's go ahead and start out with formal wear. You know, this is super important. So first we have the groom's outfit. So let's go ahead and do a quick little drawing here. And uh, we'll see what we get. I'm not going to look. Okay, we got red. So that means dislike. Already she's giving me attitude. And you know what? You should be glad that I'm even planning your wedding. Because you know what? I could have, like, took your money and then went bye-bye without even planning your wedding. So, you know, be thankful. Anyways, okay, so let's go ahead and pick what she doesn't want. Um, so she likes these. Um, that's kind of a problem because, see, we're not, okay. This one we're going to do because we're just following fate. You know, this is what fate says. And let's go ahead and pick a color. And we'll, what is the color theme of this wedding going to be? Um, let's do black because, you know what, black, black is nice, right? And uh, it just screams wedding. So we'll do black. We'll just do all black. Okay, next for parents, um, let's go ahead and do a drawing here. We got red. <laughs> Don't get too excited, girl, because so far this isn't going so well. So, I know, you really like this one, and let's make sure it's all black. There you go. And then for the mama, let's... Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I don't make the rules, okay? Uh, yeah, we'll do this one, and then we'll do we'll do gray. We're just gonna do all dark colors. You know, that's the theme of this wedding. It's just dark. Why is she making that face? Like, is it just me, or is she kind of like... Girl, these, this family has attitudes. See, they said Canadians are nice. You know, that's what they say, but like, this Canadian family has some attitude, and I don't like it. You know, I'm Minnesotan, and they say Minnesotan nice, but guess what? I'm not that nice either. I mean, I'm kind of nice, but... Ooh, you got yourself your first green. Okay, so we'll pick what you like. Um, you don't like this guy, you don't like that guy, but you do like this guy. Because you dated in high school. I, a girl, a girl, I see right through you. I see right through you. Another green! Wow! Oh, oh, I I see it. So because you dated this guy in high school, you just, you want all the right things. That's what, okay, fate's on your side now, right? Because it wants your, you know, this guy you have a crush on to look good. Wow. But there you go, and also we're doing all black, so. <laughs> Maid of Honor, let's see. We got, ooh, we got red. I'm sorry, we're going to pick your enemy, your high school enemy, which is this girl here. I know you're very excited to have her at the wedding. I know, me too. I'm excited to see this. Green. Okay, so we'll pick the dress that you like. Okay, this one, great. And then we'll do gray. Wow, that looks 
so bridal. Imagine if we don't get the child that she wants to have at the wedding. Okay, we do. All right, so she likes this kid. She doesn't like that kid. She also likes this kid. We'll do the first one. There you go. And then for clothes, um, you know, just keep keeping up with the freaking thing. I'll, I will say, um, doing this every single time. <laughs> so I might end up skipping through some of these. I promise you, I promise right now, pinky swear that I will do a drawing every time and it will just be a surprise because, you know, if I were to do this, um, it would take me like five years and this video would be super freaking long. Um, red. Okay. So, um, we're going with little Karen here. Okay. Little Karen. And then for outfit. Ooh, uh, yikes. Okay, so we'll, g yeah, I know. It looks good. Okay, and then for dark, we'll do red. Why not? It matches the darkness. You also match the couch, so. I do want to show this part because I feel like it's very important. Uh, we need to deconstruct our groom's face and uh, make it the way that she wants or doesn't want. So I this is a very important part of, you know, someone's face. Um, okay, so we'll give them, we'll give, we'll give them what you want. Um, sure, we'll do that. And then skin color. Uh, we'll do, we'll do a drawing. Okay, so give, give you what you want. We'll just stick with this. Sure, why not? Okay, and then for hair, um, already she's giving me attitude about this hairdo. Girl, we'll let fate decide, okay? Um, okay. We haven't got red in a while. I kind of, I kind of am concerned. Okay, so... Hannah, you're telling me you like this hairdo. You sure? Uh, yikes. Okay, with, okay, the question is, which one do we like better? This one or this? This one. Definitely this one. I shape. Okay, um, I shape. All right, which one do you like? You like this one? Okay, and then eye color. Let's just, I'm gonna pick for you. Well, yes. They almost look black, you know, it goes with the wedding theme. And then for eyebrows, um, red! Oh no. So... Huh. Interesting. We'll go with these ones, um, because, again, we're letting fate decide. And then for lips, um, we'll do... Ooh! <laughs> Some more red. Okay, um, what are we gonna give you? Mm, which one? Okay, we'll do this. Oh yeah, he looks very... handsome yeah that's that's exactly what he looks like now we have to pick the officiant or priest or whoever and um you know this is also very important i do really hope that we get elvis again just because i feel like all of these people boring like that's boring i want elvis to be our officiant like is that just me i don't think it's just me. I think it, I think everyone's thinking the same thing. Um, even I could tell by the look on her face. You know, she really wants Elvis to be the officiant. But we'll go ahead and let fate decide. So let's see here. Ooh, girlfriend. Looks like we're probably going to have Elvis. I mean, come on. Let's celebrate here. So let's go ahead and um, just pick a random person. Sure. Yes. Awesome. For your venue, this is also super important. But again, we're letting fate decide. So let's go ahead and draw. So she got lucky with this one. Um, so let's go ahead and pick what she actually wants. Um, okay. So let's go ahead and do this one because we haven't done this location yet. So let's go ahead here and start out with her bridal main outfit here. So starting out with the dress. This is so important, right? So let's go ahead and see what fate decides. We got green mm, interesting okay so we had to pick something that she actually likes unfortunately um which so far she seems to like all of them so that's that um how about we do this one i do like this one and then we'll do gray looks good okay and then for her veil she wants something or i guess fate wants to give her something that she doesn't like so let's see here she likes all of them Huh. 
<sighs> okay, so, um, let's do this one, sure, and then we'll do gray. Yeah, that looks so, like, like, that just screams wedding. And then for gloves, Fate says that you should get something you like, which, knowing her, she'll probably like all of them. Um, and, ooh, except that one, but uh, which ones do I like the most? That's a question. I think we'll do these. Sure, why not? Very, oh yes, that looks really good. It actually, I'm kind of, why am I kind of liking it? Should I do gray at my wedding? Should I have a gray dress? Something you like. Okay, what do you like, girlfriend? Does she not like any of them? Okay, she like the only one she likes is this. And then for lips, I hope we get, I hope, I want to do black. I feel like we have to do black. This isn't lips, is it? No, it's eyeshadow. Okay, I feel like we have to do black, but let's let, let's let fate decide. Um, okay, something she likes. Okay, fine, whatever. Um, all these look terrible, but sure. And then for lips, oh my gosh, please give us a red so I can give her black lips. Does she like black lips? She does. Oh, she does like. Okay, so give us a green, please. Green. So we're not going to be giving her black lips, um, unfortunately. Does she like all of them? She, she doesn't like gray, but you know what? It matches your outfit, so we will keep that. And then for bridal hair, um, what... We give you something you don't like. Ooh, this is going to be fun. I mean, not fun. Why would I say that? So, what do you not like? Okay, she doesn't like a bun. She doesn't like a classic bun, but she likes spider hair. Okay interesting i do really like this one i don't know something about the bangs it's the bangs for me so let's do black um obviously it's time to watch the wedding now this is super exciting we're gonna see how this goes welcome to my wedding hannah oh yes okay so there's no one in the audience again i don't know why this keeps happening no one's coming to our wedding but you know it's covid <gasps> elvis So no one came to the wedding, but at least Elvis came. You can always trust on Elvis to come to the wedding. He's out of breath. So here's our maid of honor. She messed up our wedding. Wow. So, so far, I mean, this is going well. I don't see a ring, okay. Uh, so is the bride- Did her dad not come to the wedding? She's also not wearing the dress. Her dad didn't come to the- Because the dad's supposed to walk her down the aisle. Oh, here he is. That looks very wedding appropriate. That's a very wedding appropriate outfit. I think- I think- I think it is, right? Okay, so far so good. I mean, she hasn't f That looked bad. You might want to go to the hospital after that. And also, your dad didn't help you that time. In the other wedding, you know, at least the bride had the dad to help, but this time, no. Hey, Elvis! Thank you for coming to the wedding because all of our friends and family, you know, decided not to come. Maybe it was just because of COVID. I don't know. But if they did choose just not to come, um... We will be unfriending a lot of people off of Facebook and deleting numbers, blocking numbers. We will be moving, in fact. Um, so yeah, thank you, Elvis, for, uh, you know, being reliable. Yeah. So, um... Her hair looks like it could, like, seriously hurt your chin. Um, it didn't turn out quite the way I wanted. We tried. You know what? We let fate decide, and, um, she had a lot of green, so I don't really, it, it seems like if you do anything wrong, the wedding will just fail. So anyways, um, if you guys want me to play this game again, honestly, I'm really enjoying this game, and I want to do Sarah's wedding next, so let me know. I'll probably film it anyways, even if no one wants to see it. Um, and also let me know, if you have any ideas on how we should, like, you know, pick the things for the wedding, let me know. Um, yeah. I think the wedding went 
okay. You know, couldn't that could it could it be better? I mean, falling down the stairs at your own wedding. Uh, I, yeah, I feel like things could be better. You know, unfortunately for her, for our you know Canadian Cana Canadian friend, um, what's her name, Hannah? Um, it didn't quite go so well. But that's okay, because you know sometimes things don't go the way you planned. So, bye. <laughs>